Hi, this is a software video review from softwaresland.com and today I'm reviewing a software called Ultraman and this is the software you must have uh, if you have multiple monitors, okay? Now it, it can do anything, pretty much anything that's related to multi multi monitors like it can let you have different display profiles okay you can see I have two two screens on my um, on my uh, on my computer and then if I click that uh, you can pretty much see what how is that happening you can swap the current monitor with the other one if I just click that and I click apply everything suddenly changes and now it asks me um, do I want to save the changes and I say no I don't want to save the changes and uh, well actually now I have to swap them uh, swap them back okay okay so this is how it looks like now and uh, okay and you can do much more than that yeah. like uh, if you have more than 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 and these monitors you can arrange them in square and single row single column other ways other ways other ways enable all monitors and uh, and more 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 and you can actually define the different settings for them okay and then you can uh, have display profiles okay uh, you can have display profiles so if you for example rotate one of your displays often you can have a, a different display profile where well, if the screen is rotated and you can actually set it to be run automatically you can add desktops to that display profile a uh, shortcut sorry on your desktop or, or anywhere else you want you can just double click an icon then and the different thing starts now you can have a, a fill called mirroring and which is uh, it actually repeats uh, now what you like if you can do one or more monitors and you can mirror what you see on one monitor to the other monitor and then you can actually even zoom uh, so if you do that then everything you see on the, around the mouse on one monitor is shown exactly uh, on the second or third monitor or, or depends how many you have just more for example just magnify and this is very good if you're doing presentations i have a projector uh, at, at that and, and everything else now it can let you have a different screen savers for different monitors. So let's say monitor one can run one screen saver, and monitor two can actually run a different screen saver at the same time. Okay, and this is very cool if you want to have different monitors or, or different sorry screen savers on the different screens. Now another thing it can do it can it can allow you to. Uh, create special shortcuts for programs to run on a certain monitor and this is really really good if you want to for example run the, the program on a certain monitor okay and let's say I'll run now notepad on monitor 1 and center it and I want it to be 400 by 400 uh, square that's the size I want it for it okay and I use normal display settings so you can have special ones and um, uh, if you have, if you want to use special ones like can you can use special ones for legacy applications like uh, some games or old software or anything else and this is very handy to, to do that now and I call that notepad okay and I'll add a desktop on and uh, add a shortcut choice on the desktop so now if I run it, it should be centered and exactly the dimensions that I set okay now it looks a little bit weird because uh, wasn't supposed to be a uh, note that wasn't supposed to be resized it resized uh, that way oh um, but this is how it works basically and you can actually do a lot of good things with that and uh, then easily edit the shortcuts as, as well and um, you can actually set a different uh, different screen savers, uh, different sorry wallpapers for different backgrounds. You can have sets of those, and it's it's, it's pretty pretty cool like that. And if you if you just have uh, certain things like uh, this one or, or another one or, or whatever you want to do, and um, you can do much more than that. You can actually have special buttons. You can have a smart taskbar on on the second monitor or a third monitor okay so it's basically the same taskbar as up here 
but on a different monitor. So the programs that are open on this monitor, you can only see them on this monitor and the programs which are on a different program, you, you can see it on the different taskbar then you can disable the secondary monitor, you can uh, you can do arrange windows, um, you can actually do much more than that, you can have a special um, special uh, buttons to windows which allow you to move windows between uh, between monitors and then you can have special hotkeys for moving monitors for moving uh, like locking the mouse to to an active window and or to primary monitor okay so if you do that uh, okay lock mouse to active window and if I just control alt uh, I'll use control alt shift X for that okay and now I'll if I press that the program should lock my mouse to this program and not let it run anywhere else okay yeah that's perfectly works I can I can't actually move my mouse anywhere else and once I close the program that is all gone if I click it again okay I'm locked in again I'm locked in again click it again and I'm out okay and there's uh, just much much more uh, things like that that you can do and and you can ignore certain monitors you can uh, you can actually do a lot of things and this is the software to have if you have more than one monitor or screen and I really really recommend that it's that good okay so this has been a software video review from softwareslant.com good luck